July 1976. Strange, unexplained blackouts in worldwide communications plague the globe. Ham radio operators all over the U.S. are picking up seemingly random, unknown radio signals. It's causing static interference with radio, television, and even telephone transmissions all across North America. This signal was a, a tapping that would go for like 10 beats and then stop for a bit and 10 beats and stop for a bit. U.S. scientists discover the cryptic signal is coming from the Soviet Union. They assign it an innocuous name. It was called the Russian woodpecker because it was the Russians that were creating this signal and the sound that the ham operators heard was essentially that sort of clicking, pecking sound. Here is an actual tape recording of the mysterious signal. Satellite photos reveal the Russians have secretly constructed a gigantic radio transmitter and are covertly transmitting extremely low frequency waves, otherwise known as ELF waves, into the atmosphere over North America. The Russians would continue beaming this signal until at least 1989, the last time they were detected. But why? The way the, the woodpecker worked was that you had a very large radar that was pumping out millions and millions of watts of radio frequency energy. And that tick, 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 tick was each time a pulse was sent out. And in each one of those pulses, there was a tremendous amount of energy. What they were trying to do is to see our ballistic missiles coming up into space and on their way into the Soviet Union. An over-the-horizon radar system meant to provide Russia with an early warning of U.S. missile launches is one possible explanation.